Okay, this is the first part home age video for Steve Fordis 52, which I call it at the card table move set. I'm going to start on with four shuffle and slot controls. The first move is called scrambling the deck, also known as washing the deck. This is of course perceived the shuffle. This is actually a form of control known as weaving. This is a bottom slug control that evolved from a move credited from Di Vernon. Start off with a modified scrape cut and this is essentially a running cut of course. This is in the hand refill shuffle. This particular sequence ends with a straight cut, a legit cut. This is a gambler's slap control or slap cut. What really happened is the packet you are controlling, you never let go. Probably the most direct bottom slap control. You can see what makes this unique is there is no stripping, no running cuts, just a riffle and a cut. Our slap is represented by ace of spade. We are going to shuffle down into the deck and further down and we actually use a pull out or push through to bring the slug back to the top. This particular sequence is called up the ladder force shuffle. We now move on to overhand shuffle. We usually base on jobs and the concept of stripping card. Control in overhand shuffle is a lot easier as it is usually based on these two concepts. In this case, we are using both jocks and also stripping the cards. This is a modified strip out or a pull out, a hustler way of doing it. It is a legit strip half of the deck. This is a half deck control. You can see how slowly you can square up the deck. This is a control that's quite a bit more than it first appear. This is a half deck control. A novel take on a classic push through. It has the pushing and squaring action that sells the move. This is of course a full deck control. Back to in the hand refill shuffle again with a full deck control. We are actually faking the cascade and the waterfall as well. This is basically a false strip with a push through which maintain the entire order of the deck. At speed, you can't really tell which section you strip the cards. One last full deck control with overhand shuffle. You are essentially stripping the card one at a time, then reverse the sequence. 